Welcome to video 10.3 C, apply congruent arcs, chords, and central angles. All right, so we've got example one here. Uh, the measure of arc AB is 102 degrees. We wanna find the measure of angle A and the measure of angle B in triangle AOB. And uh, O is the center point. Okay, so since this arc is 102 degrees, that means the central angle is 102 degrees. I also know that this is a radius and this is a radius, so those two things are congruent. So if I wanted to, I could call that x and that x, and then I know the sum of the degrees in a triangle is 180. So I could say x plus x plus 102 equals 180. 2x, I'll just do baby steps, plus 102 equals 180. 2x equals, take away 100, and I get 80, two more, 78. Divide by two, x equals 39 uh, degrees. Okay, and that would be for both measures of angle A and B. So angle A equals 39 degrees, and angle B equals 39 degrees. Um, okay, example 2A. What fractional part of a circle is 36 degrees and then 200 degrees? All right, so all we have to know is that a circle has 360 degrees. And now we're just doing a ratio. So this would be 36 over 360. So that's gonna be 1 tenth. For 200, that'll be 200 over 360 cancel the zeros, 20 over 36, divide through by four, five times, divide through by four, nine times. So I get five ninths. Okay, uh, example 2B. Find the measure of an arc, so that's gonna be in degrees, that is seven twelfths of its circle. All right, once again, the whole circle is 360 degrees, so it would be 7 twelfths times 360 degrees. I could put that over 1. I know 12 goes into 36 three times, add the 0, so that'll be 30, and then 7 times 30 is 210. I always like to make sure if my answers make sense, this is slightly over half of a circle, so this should be slightly over 180 degrees. That kind of makes sense. All right, and I wrote in uh, one more example. Please put that in your notes. It's called example 2C. Find the length of arc AB. So I'm looking for the distance from point A to B along the circle. Uh, the central angle is 30 degrees, and the radius is eight centimeters. So what you need to know is the formula for the circumference of a circle. So the circumference of a circle equals two pi r, or pi d, but two pi r is easier. And then this um, length is just gonna be a fraction of that whole uh, circumference. So the arc length will equal the fraction times the whole circumference. Okay, so the fraction is gonna be 30 degrees over 360. And the whole circumference is gonna be uh, two pi r. Two pi eight. Okay, so let me reduce the zeros cancel. Uh, 3 over 3, that's going to be 1 over 12 times 16 pi over 1. 4 goes into 12 3 times. 4 goes into 16 4 times. So my final answer will be 4 pi over 3. 4 pi over 3 centimeters. Again, unless otherwise specified, always report exact simplified answers. So there you have it, a couple application problems with congruent chords, arcs, and central angles.